Okay, now to set up your tractor or machine for the field and AB line that you're using, I'll take you through the process. Pull up a home screen that has this information on that right hand side panel there. Now a lot of this will already be input in place, uh, but I'll take you through the whole process as though there's nothing in there, just to go through the, the whole process. So the first drop down menu on this side at the top right is client. So I click on that and then in this case we select South Banaba Ag and then the farm that you're working on. This time it's South Banaba Irrigation. Then the field that you're in and we're in field four. Um, now in this case we've got a coverage map <coughs> from where I've already been working. Um, if you were pulling into the paddock for the first time, or you were starting a paddock, sorry, and there were a pre-existing coverage map, you'd want to clear that coverage map, so you start with a clean slate. In this case, I want to continue with the coverage from the work I've already been doing. Now, we need to double check our tracking mode. Uh, it will always be straight track for uh, row work like this, so just double check that you've got straight track. Then we need to pick the AB line that we're using. Um, so we click on the set track zero icon there. If there's only one AB line for that paddock, it will automatically come up and it'll name the AB line just there. But in this case, there's more than one. So we click on set track zero and then click on the drop down menu. Now all the AB lines for, the, for every field will be already in the green star display so there's no need to add or change any ab lines they should all already be there in these irrigation fields we've got normally a head ditch ab line one for the rows and one for the tail drain now we're just doing work in the rows here so i'll select that ab line and then you just need to make sure that the total shifts are zero for irrigation work there are never to be any shifts in uh, against a grain uh, AB line. Sometimes they will be used. They'll be preset in uh, dryland or broadacre fields, but for irrigation, it's always to be zero. If you check that and you find there is a shift in there, contact your manager, and we will sort that out. But that one's got zero, so it's all okay to go. So we click on the accept button. And then you'll see the AB lines have turned up on our display. And then you'll also see this little four quarter pie here. Now that we've got an AB line in there, it's half filled in with blue. When I then click on steering on, a third quarter will be added. And then to engage, so that's got the auto steer turned on, it's ready to be engaged. Then we click on the resume button. In this case, it's this auto button here on this tractor. So if I click on that, that little pie chart will be filled with all the quarters and an A will come on and we'll be away.